for joining us today here on Modern Living TV. It's another episode of new experiences that we can share with you and engage with because after all, life is supposed to be an adventure, right? Yes, yes, definitely. I myself am an adventure junkie and that's why we seek new ideas and feature ways on how we can inject some excitement and inspiration to our everyday journeys. It's a gastronomic adventure for us today as we sample some Chinese comfort food and revel in the nostalgia in this cafe with Filipino American Grub. We will also learn about Torre Lorenzo Loyola, another premier property from the pioneer of student-centric condos in the country. Or you can also go the extra mile and change your decor with these furnishings from Orientique. So turn your home into something reminiscent of an Asian destination. From living spaces to living life beyond its confines, this is your ultimate guide to modern living. College life is a balancing act of earning a degree and acquiring valuable life lessons as students venture out independently. And for this very crucial phase, a living space where they can thrive is a must. Learning transcends beyond classrooms and extends into social activities outside school grounds and the need for a safe and conducive environment for learning is what Torre Lorenzo Development Corporation has addressed with their premium university residences. Back in the day when housing options for students were limited to dormitories and bed spaces, TLDC pioneered the concept of a living space specifically designed for students through their first premium university residences, the Torre Lorenzo 1 and 2 near De La Salle University in Taft Avenue, Manila, and the Torre Lorenzo Central near USD in Sampaloc, Manila. Building on the successes of these properties, TLDC continues to innovate with the launch of its latest offering, the Torre Lorenzo Loyola. So we are here in Torre Lorenzo in Loyola, along Katipunan. And tell us the vision for this specific property that you have. For I think the last 20 years, we've been heavily involved in building premium university residences. Um, let me be clear, we do not do dormitories. Rather, we pioneered and developed and continue to build the um, premium university residence um, model in the Philippines. And how did this start? It's because when I came back from uh, my studies abroad, you know, I was looking at universities in the United States and I noticed that the residences of the of all these students, they were they were very clean, very decent, um, very large. And I, I thought, well, when, if I go back to the Philippines, I want to do that. I want to give students something better than what they expect. And we haven't looked back since. We, we, we've continued um, building. We have several buildings in the La Salle area. We also have uh, near the UP Manila Med Medical School area. We have at the uh, UST area and even schools like Perpetual uh, University in Las Piñas, we have buildings like these. So it's really to upgrade the lifestyle of the student in the Philippines. Located in Loyola Heights, Quezon City, Torre Lorenzo Loyola is a high-rise condominium strategically located near UP Diliman and Miriam College and merely walking distance to Ateneo de Manila University. Nearby establishments include commercial spaces, transportation hubs, as well as social spaces making Torre Lorenzo Loyola an ideal second home for students in the Katipunan area. The most important thing that my daughter told me, she said, it's not being on Katipunan that really matters. It's being as close to that pedestrian overpass that matters. So this property that, that, that we're building on is seven minutes to the classroom. I want to make sure that when we talk to our buyers, we say it's seven minutes to the classroom. We don't say it's near the school and it's one tricycle ride away or one jeepney ride. Like its previous premier university residences, Torre Lorenzo Loyola also follows the Students First program of TLDC, a standard that was designed to ensure that student residents will achieve a study-life balance through the facilities and services that TLDC will provide. 
Its first pillar, Safety First, ensures the security of its students' residents through security features such as CCTV cameras and RFID access with parent notification feature. So what's really important to us is security and more security and more security. That's why it's important that um, the parents feel that their, their son or daughter is cared for. And one of the major differences you have from other developers in terms of providing security for the students is your RFID uh, system. <laughs> Tell us about that. Our RFID system, um, when the resident taps into the RFID, like, an, like in a hotel, door, first door opens, it's a, it's a lobby, and right away the receptionist sees all information about that, that resident and any exclusions or inclusions that the parents want to put there. At the same time, uh, we have a new feature where a text message is sent to the parents that the son or daughter, the son or daughter has arrived. Mm -hmm. We also have cameras all over, not in the unit of course, mm -hmm. but yes. basically the moment the student step, the resident steps out of his unit, takes the elevator, leaves, walking away from the building, that is all captured. Because that is what the parents want to know, that is my son or daughter safe? The second pillar called Studies First includes building an environment conducive for learning such as study halls and meeting rooms, all equipped with Wi-Fi connectivity. Convenience First is the third pillar and deals with providing 24-7 resident assistance, touch payment facilities, and commercial spaces that cater to merchants that serve student needs. The last pillar is called Balanced Life First, which deals with state-of-the-art amenities so student residents can have a healthy and sound mind and body. We provide properties where uh, the resident has the best amenities possible. So we upgrade their lifestyle. In our buildings, we put everything from high-end gyms, fitness, fitness centers. We put a lot of outdoor spaces. We put study rooms, uh, both for guests and residents and, and uh, exclusively for residents. We even choose the uh, commercial establishments on the ground floor they must be for the students. We do not allow establishments which will not really be in sync with getting the students to study harder or sleep more or finish on time. With the Students First program in place, student residents are assured of an elevated living experience throughout their college life. As for their personal spaces, units are furnished and designed with the students' welfare and comfort in mind. We make 20 years, 20 years of experience in what works and what doesn't right. work. We want to make sure that it's moving ready. And it's very, very spacious, I have it's, to say. It's very, it's very, like very... Like it's not, like it's a separate area totally for the toilet and the sink and the, it's not cramped up. Correct. The tipong gumano ka lang, you're in the sink na, yeah. The other innovation we have is with the ceilings. We make the ceilings very, very high. Yes, it's super high. Like, does it feel like living in a box? As, yes, as, as that's the, the, that's the idea. We living. make sure that the high, ceilings are high so that it allows us to have proper bunk beds. And the bunk beds, even if you are a six footer sleeping on the top bunk, when you wake up, you're not gonna hit your head and yeah. get knocked out. Yeah. So we have that, we've, we've uh, made sure that it is equal, it's an equal living, living experience for the person on the top bunk or the bottom bunk. So if you see this bed, you'll be like, where's the steps? Uh, where's the ladder? Voila, because you made it steps. Because steps. Because people don't want to sleep on the, on the top bunk if they have to climb a mm -hmm. ladder. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's fun when you're, like I said, when you're five yeah. years old or 10 years old, but not when you're 18 years old and you're tired. Yes, and the real steps actually uh, are multifunction because this because storage. they are storage. The stylish units and well-thought-out amenities and facilities of Torre Lorenzo Loyola and their premium university residences are a result of TLDC's meticulous planning and intuitive approach to all its projects. It's no wonder that they recently bagged the Best Boutique Developer title, among other awards, at the Property Guru Philippine Property Awards. Okay, so behind us on this shelf, we have um, 
a few awards and a few trophies. Now, tell us what that means to you and your company. We actually won for our high-end residential developments. Really, our, our business plan is to be a developer that sees opportunities early on and takes those opportunities before anyone else can see it. And I said, you know, let's do a high-end project in Davao. And at that time, we were thinking of the idea of coming up with bigger projects, not just single tower projects, but really mixed use, larger developments um, with multi-story uh, structures. We, although we started with university residences, we really moved on to hotels, um, high-end condominiums, we even have high-end resorts. By building living spaces for learning, Torre Lorenzo Development Corporation revolutionized the housing options for students with their premium university residences, a second home that's safe and secure where student residents can focus on reaching their academic goals, acquiring life skills, and making those dreams come true. We're personalized in our service. We make sure that they are like home and they are the, their servant, they are the yaya. 